Do COVID-19 vaccines contain 81 strands of bacteria and HIV? No, that's not true. A video showing a masked woman making false claims about COVID vaccines is an altered audio and video package from a real interview done by Vice Media with a medical professional. Then dubbed over with audio from a Canadian organization that published an interview with a natural doctor. Experts from UCLA and the University of Southern California told lead stories that the vaccines do not contain bacteria or HIV and debunked other false COVID vaccine claims in the video. The claim appeared as a video, published on Facebook on January 9, 2022. The audio opened in the middle of a sentence, quote, Doctor, and I have 1,600 patients, many are vaccinated, just to give you a little bit of backstory about my credibility. End quote. This is what the post looked like on Facebook at the time of writing. Source. Facebook screenshot taken on 2 Jan 2023 hours 0 minutes and 34 seconds 2022 UTC. The 443 video is a mashup of video from a legitimate interview Vice Media did in October 2020 with a doctor with the National Health Service in England who described her experience working during the pandemic while she was pregnant. That video can be found on YouTube here. That doctor did not want to be identified and wore the mask to conceal her face. Her accent seems to be British. She did not speak about COVID vaccines during any point in the 545 Vice video. Her audio was not used in the video posted to Facebook. The audio is from Canadian organization Together as One titled, Natural Doctor Video, and has no images. The website states the reason the speaker is not seen on camera is that, at present, the natural doctor is not ready to go public, but the moment she does, we will create a follow-up video with any and all material that we can share. Please stay posted on our platform for further news. The voice could be Canadian based on pronunciations in the video. The TAO Facebook page states their mission. Quote, TAO, together as one, is a platform already created for Canadians and AMP citizens of the world who are ready to join a bigger movement to stop our government's tyranny. This group is to educate and discuss topics that are occurring and to unite us all to stand up for our rights and AMP. Freedom. End quote. The manipulated video was published on several social media sites such as Telegram and on the website BitChute with the headline, Another Doctor Tries to Warn U.S. Will you hear her? Lead Stories has debunked multiple false claims published by BitChute here. The video appears to edit out text messages that appear on the screen but do use several, including a message at 421 that reads, The government have lied to US, which is the same message that appears on the original video at 509. In the original audio the voice of the person speaking matches the message. However, on the altered video the audio does not match and does not say, The government have lied to us, a British grammar form using the plural for government. The natural doctor, speaking on the altered video makes several false claims about the COVID vaccines. At 038, the voice says, quote, The first vaccine as it goes into your body it has a small amount of saline and a bunch of ingredients that are very catastrophic to your cellular system. What that does to your immune system, which is your bone marrow, your thymus gland, your spleen and all other systems associated with your immune system. It decreases the ability to produce white blood cells by 50% from your first vaccine. End quote. At 152 in the video the voice says, quote, The booster has 81 strands of foreign bacteria that your cells have never come across. You don't have the antibodies to fight it. End quote. At 244 the voice says, quote, Then you get your second booster. What the second booster has. It has eight strands of HIV and now what that does it completely shuts off your ability to make white blood cells. And if you Google what that disease is, it is HIV. End quote. Rita Burke, Associate Professor of Clinical Population and Public Health Sciences at the University of Southern California, told lead stories via email on January 20, 2022, that the claims are false. She shared the list of ingredients found in the Pfizer-BioNTech, Moderna and Janssen vaccines. None contain HIV or bacteria. She explained, quote, vaccines are meant to protect and therefore, would not contain ingredients that would get someone sick with another disease, such as HIV or foreign bacteria. End quote. 
UCLA virologist Dr. Otto Young told Lead Stories by phone on January 20, 2022, that the COVID vaccines do not have bacteria or HIV in them. Quote, what if you said that Burger King burgers are made with cat meat, you know? I mean, how do you respond to that? All you can say is no, they're not. <laughs>